ghostly statues wait on the crumbling platform for a train that will never come. And for those drivers waiting for it to be renovated, the state DOT says it's not going to happen. The platform is a, a historic remnant, but it really serves no current transportation use. So spending any money on it just doesn't seem to be the right thing to do, especially when there's so much other need out there. For many drivers coming into Syracuse, the train platform is their welcome to downtown. The roof has holes, the floor is deteriorating, and this eyesore is only going to get worse. Does this mean the state is going to look at demolition? Uh, no. Um, we're just going to let it be exposed to the elements, and sooner or later, Mother Nature will take care of it. The DOT says five or six years ago, an unnamed private organization was interested in restoring the platform, but it did not work out. It, yeah. it seemed like it was going to go through, and then uh, they raised about half the money, and then they couldn't raise the rest of it. The state DOT recognizes that many people will be disappointed, but says the taxpayer money that would be spent restoring the train platform could instead go towards replacement of an aging bridge. We'd rather spend money on bridges and roads that actually need it right. and do serve a purpose. The DOT says as of right now, the only way this train platform could be renovated is if private funding is willing to pay for it. For now, reporting from Syracuse, I'm Alex Dunbar.